Well, good day, YouTubers, friends, and family from across the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew, Daily Events Worldwide, September 14th, 2018. If you haven't already, be sure to hit that notification bell, hit that like button if you like what you're seeing today. Welcome to another surviving day on this planet. We are looking at NASA worldview images of Category 5 Super Typhoon Meng Cut right here. And this is Tropical Storm Florence, who is a Category 1 stalling in the Carolina States right now, bringing mass amounts of water. And also looking over the Atlantic Ocean at Helene and Joyce, and also a small sandstorm off the coast of Africa. Seven day composite image here, overlooking North America, watching the last few days of the life of Florence as it heads into the Carolina States. Two foot storm surge came through last night. Videos and news coming out of both Carolina states. Mass amounts of storm surge water heading into the cities. You can see that high pressure blockade, cold air from Canada stalling it. So here are looking at storm coverage. We have four named storms and five, four areas of interest. I'm gonna look here first, satellite image of Nankut, category five, who is momentarily, like literally an hour away from the eye wall hitting the northern islands of the Philippines, Luzon, Manila. And then we're looking at Helene, satellite imagery of Helene and Joyce. And Helene is, believe it or not, on her way to Ireland, United Kingdom, parts of London. So Europe, get ready. There is a tropical storm heading your way. And her name is Helene. Let's hope she doesn't gain any strength. It seems to be losing as it heads north into the colder waters. And then a look at satellite imagery of Florence. Florence is a category one, and you can see here, this satellite imagery, it is stalling, high pressure blockade, northern cold air. Stay aware and prepared folks. Thank you for joining me today. We're gonna look at the total precipitable water from around the world. And we had another glitchy thing happen over the Pacific Ocean this time. Watch this. Like, what was that? I'm not sure, man. Definitely, uh, you don't see that every day on this. But when you do, there's always a large hurricane spinning. Very interesting. Overlooking the Atlantic here. And that was yesterday. Pretty cool images coming out of NASA. CIMSS, thank you very much. All right, let's get to around the world for weather five day forecast brought to you by Meteo Mike and Meteo Earth. Looking at the tra trajectory of Florence, I have the storm heading just south of Cliffside and Florence. I've got a new a few new subscribers from the Carolina States. Stay safe, you guys. That storm is still a storm to contend with. Here we are, trajectory for Helene. Very strong winds. Once it finally makes land, there's a large low pressure above. I mean, you see those tight isobars. That's when we've got very strong winds. We've also got Mancut heading now across the Philippines and into the South China Sea. So Thailand is on watch now and parts of southwestern China. 
as Meng Cut is still a Category 5 and will be a Category 3 when it hits China and Thailand. Also watching in the Indian Ocean, Tropical Cyclone Development, right here. Doesn't look like it will form into anything, but if it does, it'll be a cyclone heading towards Madagascar. We'll see what happens here in the coming days. But around the world, major disasters right now are, of course, Florence, Nankut, and snow. That's right. Winter setting in in Alberta, northern parts of Alberta especially, but the foothills and just east of the foothills, seeing snow over the next couple days and some very strong northwest winds, temperatures most likely dipping to minus five, if not colder, in the next couple days. So yeah, winter is here. Welcome to 2018 winter. It will be one to talk about for the ages. If you don't believe me, just wait and see. Four months from now, when we're sitting in January, we will see. We're going to look at the last 24 hours for earthquakes from around the world. And we had a lot of action in South America and also Aleutian Islands, Alaska. Few earthquakes popping off in India and also northwest China. Indonesia here as well, 5.0, 5.9. Now this is today, guys. More shallow earthquakes. But we have had a lot of deep earthquakes this week. Around the world we go. Kermadak Islands, that was yesterday. East Pacific Rise, as well as yesterday. But all these earthquakes in South America makes me wonder how those volcanoes are doing. I'm going to have to look into those and see if there is a heightened risk. 120 kilometer depth, 5.4 in Peru. So yeah, stay aware and prepared. Thanks for watching today. This has been Mike with Morning Dew, daily events worldwide. As I said, be sure to hit that notification bell sometimes twice to make sure that you're getting every upload and every notification. Stay aware and prepared. We're going to leave you here with the last seven days for earthquakes. Much love from Meteo Mike with Morning Dew. Stay young and have fun and get your morning dew. Bye-bye. Please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.